Whenever I think about the, the Chiefs, my mind goes to that playoff game against the Bills. In my opinion, the best game from last season, playoffs or not. And now the Bills come into camp with some expectations. And Josh Allen is there in training camp, and here's what he said about those expectations for this season. We're a new team. We're a different team. You know, we know that. We understand that. We've got new pieces. We've got a, a new offensive coordinator. Um, we've got a new mindset. So, again, just trying to find how what, what we are, what our identity is. That's, that's really what training camp is for. There's no higher expectations than what we have for ourselves in the locker room. And, again, I think if you're a team that doesn't have – Super Bowl or nothing, you know, in your minds, I don't think that you're doing it the right way. Obviously, that's that's the main goal is to win world championships, and um, we got to find a way to get it done. But, again, it starts with week one. Well, Mike T, in training camp, all teams are dreaming about the Super Bowl. However, we're talking about the Chiefs and the Bills, the two top teams favored to go to the Super Bowl from the AFC. Which one do you think would be more likely to find themselves in the Super Bowl this year? The Bills and really some of their offseason additions, most notably – Von Miller, if Von Miller is anywhere close to what he's been in the past, this pass rush could be the difference maker in terms of them getting over the hump. You know, they've put a lot of resources on defense the last couple of years. Ed Oliver is a one, Greg Rousseau is a one. They have a first round pick, Kair Elam at corner. So they've put a lot of resources on defense and Von Miller could be the guy that gets them over the edge just in terms of closing out a game, something they couldn't do against the Chiefs last year. Exactly. Sam, if they were running back that matchup, that great game right now, week one, if they were, who would you have winning a matchup between the Bills and the Chiefs? Man, well, week one is tough, right? Because uh, it, you don't have Dayball anymore. Week one, I'll probably go with the Chiefs, right? Like, you don't have Brian Dayball. You have a new offensive coordinator if you're the Bills. But if you go down the line, not week one, but week 17, divisional round, playoffs, right? You replay that game in, 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 the, in, the, in the playoffs. I think the Bills find a way to pull that game off. And mainly because, yes, Von Miller is that reason. But also because you've lost so many times. Like, you were doing everything in your power to find a way. Like, for the years, it was, let's find a way to beat New England. Well, they've done that. They own the division now. They have to find a way to beat Kansas City, and you've added pieces to help build that, and that's why you go and you bring in a guy like Von Miller. And so for me, uh, the question isn't what do you, what happens in week one. It what hap it's what happens in the AFC Championship game. I think the Buffalo, hopefully, obviously it's, what, June, July? But I think they'll be able to pull it off. <laughs> I think that's a fair point. That was very hypothetical. But, Dan, I'm going to ask you a very real question. We've focused so much on the Chiefs and the Bills in the AFC. What other teams could you see challenging them throughout the season and in the playoffs? Uh, the team that won the AFC last year in Cincinnati, right? I mean, uh, they're still there, right? They, they went in there and beat uh, Kansas City in their building uh, in the AFC championship game. So they're not to be taken lightly, that's for sure. Look, the Chiefs are in a loaded division. You can see any of the teams in the AFC West winning that division. I think Baltimore bounces back. I think the Colts are a legitimate threat. The AFC is stacked. Uh, and, and I think that's that, that's something to consider when we talk about Chiefs Bills. They, they probably look like the two best teams until someone proves otherwise. But A, the Bengals kind of did. Uh, and, and B, you know, the, the, the Bills are in a much easier, I think, division than Kansas City. So they're in a position where they could come into the playoffs with a better record. And maybe that game is in Buffalo instead of Kansas City this year. That could make the difference. Interesting. Well, we're turning our attention to the NBA where comparing errors in the